I've been using the word treason and traitor for the whole time he's been in office. And every guest I've had on the show has been saying I was an alarmist and I was overstating the case. I don't hear that anymore. I hear those words used a lot more. Yeah, I mean, the Mueller report, the full one came out, and if you haven't read it, spoiler alert, hope dies in the end. <laughs> it was like all the president's men meet Al Capone's vault. Here's the thing about Bob Mueller. He's like the last person, maybe the last thing in America that left and right agreed on. This is a guy of honor. This is an honest guy. This is an honest broker. Whatever he says goes. The fact that he was like, uh -huh. but, but this was our big gun. Because they were waiting for Mueller. We all sat around waiting for prosecutor Jesus to turn in his big report. <laughs> and he came back with, ask someone else. <laughs> we needed Superman and we got Clark Kent. I get it. Mueller's a Boy Scout, a straight arrow. He played it by the book. But you may have noticed for the past three years, we're kind of been off book. And greatness sometimes means not doing everything by the book. All he had to do is what people in the justice system do every day. Use the law to come to justice, not be so restricted by technicalities that the bad guys win. I did not feel good about this Mueller report. I mean, I feel different about everything around. Bob, your trail of breadcrumbs isn't good enough. We're not that smart anymore. <laughs> and you, tough guy, couldn't get the president's taxes? You didn't follow the money? You didn't interview Trump, we're told, because he couldn't possibly testify under oath without perjuring himself? And that's our problem? It's one feckless punt after another. I think the question for everybody is, who, whose side are you on? Are you on the FBI side? I mean, he's got Republicans now attacking the FBI and all mm. our institutions. Mueller could have done that, and the headline the next day would have been, Mueller breaks with precedent, indicts Trump, and then that would be our new reality. Are you with Trump? This one man, this one sick man, or are you with the FBI? Are you with the rule of law, or are you with Donald Trump? Because now Trump goes into the election as a vindicated martyr. <laughs> Thanks for that, Robert Mueller.